basketball. They say you need five players for a team, but here you will struggle to even find one. Oi, immigrant! You're supposed to use feet! Yes, JJ Okocha. <laughs> Quiet, Dean. Um, Diem. Just call me Diembe for short, miss. Um, Diembe Chimbaya. Baya. Baya. Diembe Chimbaya. Uh, Tony, you'll be looking after Diembe today. Um, if you don't need books, page 127. Gonna do some work on textile-based materials. <laughs> Why is your bag so big? I've got my basketball inside. Ah. Well, I don't know what school's like in Kenya, but here, you've got to put up with three things. Stupid questions. Did you live in a mud hut? <laughs> Touchy-feely girls. Your hair looks ace. Can I touch it? <laughs> <laughs> and chips with everything. Have you seen hyena? No. Uh, have you seen an elephant? Only in a zoo. What? That doesn't make any sense. How can you have a zoo in the wild? Oh, Dave, that man. Go on, bug off. People annoy you, mate. You just need to tell them that they need to bog off. Bog off? Yeah, it's like telling them to leave you alone. But if you don't like them. <laughs> How can I not like them if I don't know them? You right, Charlie? Yeah, I'm right, Dean. Just eating lunch. And you, Diane Bay? Did I pronounce that right? Yes. You've been getting asked a lot of questions, haven't you? Yes, there's been a lot of questions. Does it get annoying? Mm, not really. I mean, i will do the same thing if I was in your position. I only know what my mother told me about England. Oh, yeah. And what did she tell you? That it's cold. Always right, and people ask a lot of questions. <laughs> yeah. I've got a question for you. Okay. You're one of those illegal immigrants, aren't you? Um, illegal? Yeah, like you're smuggled over here on a shipping container. No, I came on a plane. Wow, they're getting a bit high tech now, aren't they? Who's getting a bit high tech? It's okay, pal. Your secret's safe with us. Right, Tony? No one needs to know that. You're an illegal immigrant! my passport to school tomorrow. Why? Does your teacher need to see it? No, not exactly. Then what for? They think I'm here illegally. I'm not right. Aish, if we were illegals, do you think I'd be working at the hospital? Those kids at school don't know that. It's just some people's way of welcoming you to their country. Okay, mom. In this house, we say grace before we eat. Hey. I'm off to work. You're, uh, you're teasing the microwave. Since when do you work night shifts? Oh, work stuck on some new lads. And some of us have to work extra shifts. Show them the ropes. Yeah, but you've just got in. Yeah, and someone's got to put the food on the table. Hey, how's school? Yeah, yeah, it's all right, it's good. You sound like you're hiding something. Well, I'm just looking after this new lad at school. Yeah, sounds good. 
Kind of chaperoning? Yeah, it's something like that. That's good. Where's he from? Um, I think he's from South of here. <laughs> Bloody Southerners. Well, he's, he's good. You know, they, they think highly of you, lad. Yeah. That's me lift. I'll see you in the morning. Yeah, I'll see you. So far, most people are friendly, but some of them want me to go back to Niger. But I keep telling them, I'm from Kenya. Okay, come in. Yellow's this side, red's this side. Hurry up. Djembe? Is that your name? Cody Yellows. It's uh, football today, son. Okay, Djembe, you go and goals. Back home, they used to put me in goals because I had the worst player on the team. Asylum Seeker in that next time. Oi, Ali, come here. Asylum Seeker is not his name. That's what he is, though. Okay, one hour's detention. But that's not fair. A football training after school. I thought you just scored eight goals, Shader. Ain't that training enough? <whistles> Alright, lads. That'll do. Change your rooms. The sun never shines in England. It's grey in the morning, grey at lunchtime, grey in the evening, grey, grey, grey. No wonder everyone is pale. And it's Chimbai for three! Boys, it's a bit dangerous on here. Oh, Tony, I didn't realize anyone used this course for anything. No, it's fine, there's nothing to be sorry for. What are you doing around here anyway? Playing basketball. No, I mean why are you at this car? It's the closest one to where I live. Is there some sort of rule that we can play here? No, of course not. It's just, you know, I wouldn't stay out too late. The people aren't exactly that friendly around here. Can I get a shot? Where's your friend? You mean Dean? Dean's in detention. Hey, what's that? Well, basically, you stay at school after school for about an hour and you can stay and do nothing. <laughs> so staying after school for an hour will make them behave? I don't know. What about in Kenya? What happens if you get in trouble there? Listen, you go outside and you pick a tree and then you pick a branch from the tree and then you get beat with it until your bottom turns as black as night. Wow, that sounds like child abuse. Well at least you get to go home on time. Touche. Touche, is that another subject? You know, it doesn't matter. Why are you at this dump anyway? Playing basketball. No, I mean, why are you in England? Everybody's water is clean. People are fed. School is free. I thought a dump is somewhere where people put their rubbish. I suppose it is. My mother works at the hospital. Fair enough. What's this? See? Easy. How about a quick game to 21? Alright, go on then.
seas tomorrow. Whoa, 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 whoa. It's a bit early, isn't it? It's just gone ahead, mate. I don't see anyone else making a move, do you? I just clocked 12 hours for you, Ben. Well, the new Africans, they put 16 hours in yesterday. And now they're getting paid for that extra time. Well, they go the extra mile, don't they? I like that. Extra mile? You mean they're working for free? OK, with the questions. All right, you clock out. That's fine. But these Africans, now they work hard. And I hear they've got friends looking for work as well. Back to where you came from, everybody. Who are you? Hello, Mr. Hall. I'm going to take a look at your arm. No, you're not. Can you get the nurse, please? I'm a nurse, sir. Now, if you let me have a look at it. Can you even talk English properly? Get me another nurse. I'm speaking English now. And I'm the only nurse currently on the ward. Now we need to treat your arm before it gets infected. How can you be the only nurse in A&E? Where are all the English nurses? I'm not sure. Maybe the English nurses don't like the night shift. Now, do you want to take a look at my English show levels? Or are you going to let me help you? The right, go ahead. Just fix it. Playing football after school. And you're not in detention tonight, now? Well, I had to put the immigrant in his place, so I know. Well, he's got a name, you know. That doesn't stop him being an immigrant. Well, I'm busy tonight. Sorry, mate. Doing what? Chilling with the immigrant. Did I say that? Why are you so bothered, anyway? I'm not bothered. But are you playing football after school? No, I'm not tonight. As I said, sorry, mate.
Get out, hey, hey, hey! You think I need this bloody place? I don't. You need me more than I bloody need you. You can sit this job up your ass. Maybe we should invite Dean to play. He might like it. Are you serious? The guy takes a mick out of you every single day. I know, but my mother told me I should always turn the other cheek. What happens when you run out of cheeks? I've got, I've got a ball at my place. Basketball? Yeah, basketball, but come on, let's be quick. We've got to go. Come on in. My dad's at work, so no one's in. I'll just be two sex, right? Who are you? Who the hell are you and what are you doing in my house? I'm DMB. Dad is with me. Since when did you start knocking about with foreigners? Is the lad have been looking after at school? We just came to get a ball. Please don't hit him. I can't give a crap. What you come to get? Get this nigger out of my ass! Do you know you've got to go with him? I'll see you tomorrow. You've really got to go, pal. He's not your pal. You know, he'll turn your back for one second and that's it. Stay away from him. You don't stick to people of your own kind. But he's a good person, Dad. He's not a good person. It's all an act. See, sooner or later, those people will take everything that you have. They'll leave you outside to die and look after their own. So just stay away from him. When are we going back home? This is home now. But you said home is where we feel welcome. But yet everyone here hates us. Not every single person in this country hates us. Don't make assumptions based on what a few people have said. No one sticks up for us. No one? What about your friend from the basketball court? Like I said, no one sticks up for us. And what can one person do? You know, when there is darkness all around us, it just takes one small candle to make it light. Okay? Good. Now, get some rest. Mr. Hall, have you been seen too? Are you still waiting for your English nurse? To the NHS, everything takes ages. Shall I have a look? So how long have you lived there for then? About a month. We're just settling in. Why? Yes, me and my son. I have a son too. How old is he? He's just turned 14. 
You haven't let the wound heal. Sitting at home isn't going to put food on the table. You know, you remind me of my older brother. No matter how sick he got or how dangerous the job, he never missed a day of work. Sounds like a wise man. Not really. It killed him in the end. He got hurt at work and never recovered. Sorry about that. No need to be sorry. That's just the reality of life in Africa. If you don't work, you don't eat. So is that why you moved here to work? No. <laughs> I moved here so my son wouldn't end up like my brother. There you go, Mr. Hall. All finished. I would have lost a pint of blood if I was waiting for an English nest. Thanks. And good luck with your son. Isn't that the immigrant kid from school? I don't know. Yeah, that's definitely him. I want to play on that court. Come on, Dean, there's plenty of other courts in the park. Nah, I want that one. White immigrant, Zach Did you hear me the first time, immigrant? I didn't see your name on the court. Well, this is my country, so it belongs to me. It belongs to us. But no one ever plays on this foot. You think you can come to my country and tell me what I can and can't use? Dean, chill out. Leave him alone. He hasn't done anything wrong. Look, it's OK. I'll go. You're not going anywhere. <coughs> Dean, leave him alone. Yeah, that's right, you monkey. Hit me! Go on, hit me! Hit me! All right, you freak. Have it your way. I told you to leave him alone. What has he ever done to you? It's not his fault he came from another country. We are all the same. Tony, it's okay. But if I didn't stop him... I know, but he's your friend. Why are you helping me? Basketball. They say for a team you need five players. But you know what? I think three is a good start. <laughs>